Okay. Oh god, that guy is really running. Alright, well let's just bring it over here somewhere. Survivor. Perfect. Epic battle! Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Adred, and we are back in True Survival. Um, yeah, I think I probably will end up doing some uh, of these other episodes and stuff. Um, just not quite yet. I will wait probably a couple more days. I'm going to use these vitamins, because apparently they give us 0.5 wellness. And wow, do we need that. So I may actually, instead of going to that... Um, Ooh. Ugh, you sound so terrible. Um, to the, the building or whatever. You, should, you would think that these would increase our bad diet, because, I mean, if they're vitamins, should give us a bit of everything. Um, well, I don't plan on getting dysentery, so... I need rather to just, you know, be a lot healthier, so... Uh, I'm going to put a bunch of these away. Oh, we'll take these because it's always good to have those. Those in there. Take these pipes out. They have a spot. I still have lots of water. Never mind. So that's okay. I haven't had a chance to actually like put anything away, which is kind of bad, but... Vitamin... Oh, what does this do? Oh, did I just waste a bunch of vitamins? Uh, make you feel a little bit stronger. Increase your w wellness. Oh, dang. Okay, guys, so... Use them... in bursts, rather than anything else. Yeah, I think what I'm going to do is um, empty my inventory. See about going back to that other airdrop. Uh drawing anything close to it away from it and then um, oh I got planks and nails oh guys um, armor station soon and then um, just getting stuff back from there that sounds like they're breaking things again uh, we're gonna separate some of these out scrap Okay, good. Uh, tonight I'll be making more javelins and whatnot. Let's just uh, increase that up. Apparently repairing stuff a lot more is good. Um, shoot, one second here. Uh, Schmaltz was saying that um, he often does something like uh, he'll take an axe like this and he'll um, put a full bunch of them in his inventory, hit like a boulder or something, and then uh, repair them. Which is an interesting idea. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here, I think. Come on, you. Uh, and then um, he gets a bit of a repair bonus and stuff from that. I'm gonna just dump some of these things so that I have room for uh, further things down the line. Uh, I can't do anything with that right now. Dump. Uh, well, I have other places for these things, so... Iron Sledgehammer. Oh, man. So good. Okay. These don't really get used except for in construction. Okay, let's just get rid of you. Bandages I've got. Pay bales. Okay, anyways, so let's try to get out of here real quick. Get to that other airdrop again. I just... I, Suddenly I'm just like, you know, it's been a bit of time for me, but I realize that uh, this would probably be a really good thing to get. And I'm torn actually thinking about it. Do I want to go in this building? Yeah, I do. But is it really the best choice? Or do I want to uh, go to, um, say, that other little house that I found? Not... No, it's bigger than this one, the last one I just was at, right? Um, by, I don't know, it's got like a whole garage and probably a couple of extra rooms in it rather than just this like single room, well, burnt out kind of shack. You know what, if I can 
hang here for a moment and get some more grain. Sunflower. I don't, it's like you shouldn't really waste the opportunity to get these things, right? If you get the opportunity. <laughs> um, it's like goldenrod. Yeah. Right now we are really trying to get our stamina up. Oh, hey, I can maybe get all of the cotton quest done too. Could be another good one. Wildflowers, well, I mean, I don't really need them right now, but uh, just as a reminder, you know, they do have their uses. So grabbing a few is probably good. Chrysanthemums, uh, I don't really know what they're good for right now. Rocks. This whole little area here is just like, pick up everything. Pick it all up. Amount of garbage. I am very hungry again. Get some aloe here. Some more yucca. That's why these little like areas that are like right on the edge of two biomes are really good for things. Oh, apparently, uh, destroying birds' nests is another good thing to do. I've been forgetting. Yes, extra feathers, maybe sometimes some cloth. Man, see this is why I think doing like another season, or, well maybe not another season, but like a little, you know, essentially a guide to true survival would be a good one, because then I can distill everything I've sort of been learning, or relearning, into it. Uh, it would be good. So then we destroy this, what do we get? Uh oh, we have a friend. There's one over there. Oh, another one there. Where's my mini bike? I'm gonna get out after I grab that. Get out! Out, 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 out. Get out of here. I don't want to linger. Uh, one of these days when I have more health, um, it'll be, you know, something that I can do, but at the moment it's not. Chicken attack! I'm gonna go a bit over this way, um, just because that way I can see if there's, I don't know, more things to get. Oh, we, there's someone there we don't want to hang out with. Let's just uh, draw people away. The spike belt be a here somewhere too, very soon. Okay. Oh god, that guy is really running. All right, well, let's just bring it over here somewhere. Survivor. Perfect. Epic battle! You're about to be mauled, son. <laughs> Sorry, dude. But, you know, to be honest, if, uh... I was that survivor, I would run. I would not be hanging out. Okay, that. See, that would be. That's worth it. Oh, don't hit the mini bike! Okay, well, we actually even have a few minutes to do a bit of scrounging here. Let's clear some of this stuff away from the mini bike so I can see it a bit better. It appears as though none of the zombies want to get me. For the moment. So I'm going to grab some more cotton. And some more wheat. Because I need it. 1% health again. Ah, oh, it just never ends. Such a silly mechanic. Oh well, that's okay. It's kind of too bad that Spider won't be back. Oh, I don't know, did I mention any of this? The spider won't be back for a while. He's taking some time off. And so, True Survival may not be back out until, say, uh, elf, until like full release or something, which is kind of crazy. Actually, let's wait. 
I gotta do some some crafting stuff. Oh, this is gonna take forever. Um, but do I have spikes? I do not. Okay. Um, how far is that house from here? Oh God! Now I wish I had that spike belt, because that, that meat would be good. Ugh, zombie. Alright, I'm out. Uh, let's drive up the road here. Because that would be better, I think. Here we go. Just sort of. Oh God, no! Oh wow, that was unbelievably quick. Stop for the spike. Okay, um, let's like drive down the road a little bit, search some cars. I can't remember if I got these ones or not. Cause the last time I got like a cool mold and stuff, so yeah, that's not that useful. We'll scrap that. That is awesome. If I could get a cooking grill out of one of these, that would be amazing. Oh, shoot. Well, I guess we'll eat that. What would I get rid of? Sand, I guess. Um... Yeah. Oh, I have a bunch of sand in here already. Alright, let's move along a little bit. Actually, let's search these garbages. Okay. A hatchet. Nice. Uh, nope. Wrong button. Okay. Keep an eye out for that guy coming towards us. We want to make sure to not get assaulted by him. Oh, I know. Never ending starvation. This is the true starv. Oh, God! Where are you? That guy. Shoot. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. 73% fuel. Um, hey, is that... What kind of tree is that? Oh, dang it, you guys. Okay, I have obviously gone too far. Oh, man, already. Basically, I was, if I hear a guy with a gun, I'm out, right? I just... Sort of my new rule that... Oh, da, 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 da. Melee survivors, I can deal with on my own terms. But... Other people are... Like, I can I can approach them, and if they... If I hear that they want to get me, I can, you know, I can leave. <laughs> but <laughs> these other ones... They're not... It's not possible. Oh, jeesh. Military guy. So, I think I need to get back to the house. And, um... Let's kind of go on a vector around. So we don't track too many of them. You know, not straight to the house anyway. And then we'll loop around and hopefully park before something gets us. I don't know how long I wait how long I'd have to be away for bad things to like spawn in the area, but 
All right. <laughs> uh oh. Oh god, no. When did that happen? Sorry, I'm really concentrating now. There we go. That's a bit better. All right. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna prepare over the night time, I guess, to go to either this building. See, this building, though, it's like, it's gonna be a whole crazy thing, which I guess is a good thing. Oh, there's an airdrop there. That's where that airdrop was. I was so close to it. Oh, man, now I want to go to it. But, uh, let's see here. Yeah, this was the house that I was thinking would be a bit better, because it's biggish. And definitely will have a lot of stuff inside. Okay, I'm just gonna die up here of starvation, apparently. Eat. Gosh. Buddy. Oh, right. I left my fire going. That's not good. I have a lot of wood, but... Off. Okay, um... Okay, so yes, now we're a bit better with these. We scrapped down two protein servings. Awesome, I did not realize that. Cool that you learn things, right? <laughs> er. All right. Um, so yeah. Um. Oh, I know you're so hungry. This town though isn't really too bad to take, and there's still a bunch of stuff in here. Plus, we're a little familiar with it. It's basically, we just need to say put like a spike belt, uh, maybe here to start with. So we have like a place, oh wait a second, there's houses right here. So maybe, maybe one here. Take this building and this building and then put one here, put one there. And then one here so that we can take more of these buildings. Let me put like two, one here and one here. <laughs> we have this one started. Um, yeah, anyways. We need to get a lot more looting done. It's essential to the game. So. Okay, we're gonna have to stop. This is sort of why I like doing the splitting these um, scrappable things into chunks. Because that way, you know, I don't have to proceed with all of it. I can stop and keep going. So let's scrap that. Wait, does it drop a can? Doesn't seem to drop a can. Okay, we have that. We'll scrap those and we'll make some meat pie. Can I scrap these? I cannot. Okay, but it seems like there's enough of these around. Oh no. Don't tell me. No, okay, good. Ho 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 ho. Scared me pretty bad there. There. Oh, is this one of the ones that needs me to be looking at it to work, or...? Hmm... 14 minutes. I doubt it wants me to keep looking at it to uh, make it do its thing. So... Um, so small, one to one, which I've got five. So I guess I'll do one large and one small? Oh wait, can I only do... let's just do the large one. There we go. Eat this. Whoa, look at that, guys. We are back to previous death state. 48. Uh, that doesn't mean we can be arrogant, though. Just means we still need to be careful. 
So I'm gonna scrap those and make more of a fruit salad just because I uh, it's a good idea. I'm gonna keep eating these just you know as time progresses correctly though this time, not uh, wasting it on this. I actually do kind of recall that from the first True Survival series, but unfortunately it was too long. I really do need to get some uh, some nails here. So I. Uh, Oh, I know, you're so pleasant. Such a pleasant place to be. Let's scrap this, because that's not too bad. Sticks. Right, we need to craft a whole ton of spikes. Do I have a spot for them? I do. Recipes. Spikes. Um, so, I, yeah, anyway, I can do that many. Let's do these in kind of batches of, say, 20? How long would that take? Oh, that's too long. Ten. Two minutes. And let's do a five. Even that's kind of bugger. Okay, so it's this way, like, I can turn some of these off, and but I will still get, like, the bonuses in the terms of that I'll get some crafting done. You guys have seen how javelins are made already, so I will wait to do those for a few minutes. Um, professional pages. So we'll keep those there. Which maybe we'll take these and take a look at the recipes. So you can use professional pages, which you collect, I think, mostly from airdrops now. But don't quote me on that. You probably want to like look it up. I'll try to figure it out before I do like a more professional. Like this is how things are game play. But uh, or if someone knows, let me know. So you need 20 of these to pick up a secondary profession. Sounds like we have a wandering horde. Whoa, they are downstairs in the basement. I can tell because there's stuff happening on both sides. This whole back wall, I think, is being assaulted. windows anyway. You know what? I should heal a bit. The better bed is downstairs, unfortunately. Okay, um, beaker. Don't scrap that, please. But yeah, so, let's see. Hit one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Holy crap, so it would take me 16 episodes to do a little bit of a let's play on each one. Okay. But I mean, you know, you'd get to like know a bit about each one. Um, these aren't really, they don't really tell you much here. So you'd have to go check the actual um, site, the, the forum that has the description of most of these here. But I guess if I was to do it, I'd go through them. Um, Mason, nice. <laughs> um, but yeah, because some of these, like, I think like electrician, you know, you get some of these electrical things, but how much of that does it help you early on, right? Like, I think these need to be discussed a bit as we go through them. I could be wrong. I mean, I know the soldier one has some good stuff, like, you know, some weapons and get some grubs and things like that, so that's good. Steel welder, is that useful? Some of these, I think, are more useful in sort of a multiplayer kind of setting. I, th I hear Thief is really good. Lots of people use Thief. Park Ranger I was looking at, too, being kind of good. Bouncer might be all right. Upper body strength, probably. Anyway, uh, there's that. I look like I'm healed, so let's um, do something else. It sounds like most of what was happening here is, is, has happened. So that's good. Um, how many nails do I need for the armor? Not arn. Arm. There is armor table 20. So I would need to take apart 10, 10 of these things to get it. 
Shall we try to make some leather? We have coal, we have that, and we have the need of brains. So, I believe no, we need... Well, let's first off see what else we can do here. One of those. Drink that. Seems like this is often working now. Okay. Good. Drink. Hopefully we still get the wellness bonus. I hear though that sometimes having to do stuff down there is more useful. Okay. And we'll put those with those. Grab these brains. Um, oh, can we scrap all of these for like protein servings? Okay, so I, I'm so happy that I figured this out. No room and queue, of course not. But this one, yes, I think so. This one, I doubt it, because it's some other weird drink. That's fine, that's fine. Um, let's put this with that. As they go together. And... Hello. See, there's lots of little things that we can definitely work on, so... Fan belt. We need to find a new mission, too. Another fan belt. Uh, how many... Cotton do we have total? 52 plus 19, 71. We need like nine more, I think. What is that mission? The mission is nine, okay, 95. Uh, so one more little patch should get us pretty close there. Early barricades. Craft a bunch of planks. Before you learn to build frames, it can be hard to it can be hard to barricade doors and windows. Craft these planks and use them for early building and securing buildings. Okay, but I don't think I can build planks. Oh. Well then, you just need nails. Okay. Nails are probably just like one or two iron, but you need an anvil, which means I need a claw hammer. So, there's that button hook. These will come through a lot quicker now. Scrap that. I think I'm going to put this as some sort of food repository. I don't know. It seems... Well, I don't know. Maybe just odds and ends. This old axe. I have a spare old axe down here. So we'll probably end up just using this one, because they are way better than... So block damage is 9. Oh, actually now my axes are finally at that level, so... Let's repair that guy. Put this one down here. That way we get some experience from that, and um, that's, you know, a good thing. Alright. Sorry that my inventory is sort of all over the place, but I mean, it's kind of good because if, say, that half of the house collapses, I don't lose absolutely everything. Unfortunately, my food is over on this side, but we can get more food later. Get more handfuls of seeds. And these could be scrapped too, eh? Probably... Sets of three? Yeah. And what do we get for them? No room in queue. Not for another five seconds. Let's figure out what we get from these guys. Because I bet you it's like grains, but it could be fruit. Grains. Perfect. That seems really good. So let's cancel that and actually just scrap that there. And 
we basically just have to wait for more to come. Could scrap this. Um, and just get some meat out of it for now, rather than waiting for eggs. Um, but I have one egg. How much how many eggs do I need for bacon and eggs? Oh, cured leather. Right. So let's do this really quick. Well, no, no, no. Let's end our bacon thought here. Bacon and eggs. Two eggs to one pork belly. Thought I saw that I picked up one or two eggs. One egg. Okay. I might have more around, but I need to start gathering them in one place so that I know that I have them. Okay. So let's make some leather now that I've... I've noticed that sometimes I do that. I kind of go off on tangents and I'm trying to correct some of those things. Oh, nice. So you need four leather to do this. Wait. Don't necessarily do this. Me. Ah, I was thinking of building my own forge. Bellows. Two sticks. Twenty animal hide. Yes. See, this is what I was thinking. So... We're actually not going to do leather. We're going to do this instead. I think I may have even started to lay this out. Is it that? And then a pipe. All the pipes were in the other room. It's odd that you can't use the barrel of a gun for it, but uh, hey, why not? Scrap this. Get some more protein. And... Oh, wait, there, there's a whole bunch right there. Yeah, so let's get the bellows made. Uh, after we learn probably something about a four. Oh, you know, it's probably locked behind, like, level 25. It might be 10. It might be 10. Apply level 10. Okay, so you gotta be 10 to do that. Okay, great. 16 points. Is there anything else that's good at this point in the game? You're just trying to get up to that... Uh, guy up there is a bit <laughs> scary sometimes. So, uh, great. Screwdriver. Uh, I'd rather get... Can we find the claw hammer? That would be kind of cool. No. No, I think we just actually need to figure out how to make one. Actually, let's craft that. Uh... Hammer. Uh, claw hammer. Yes, yeah, so we actually just do need a hammerhead. Um, and for that, we need the cooking grill. But as you'll be able to see, that isn't available to us, cooking grill, until we get a skill. Uh, cooking utensils used to use in the campfire, unlock recipes. A cooking grill. A cooking utensil used in the campfire to unlock recipes. Yes. Okay, I get it. Because it unlocks them. Not as you use them. But then, yeah. But you need cooking gear. Level 25. Which is 10 levels above us at the moment. So. And I am nearly out of food. Once again. Um... I need some more veggies. But my biggest problem is veggies. Yeah, see, they're really destroying so much stuff downstairs. It's kind of, kind of terrible. Five. Can't. Takes up five more minutes of my time. That's okay. Eat. Oh yeah, see there was the axe head there, right? But unfortunately need the dang cooking grill. But I have everything else. But now we need for a forge like a 
hundred. Um, of these things here. So it's not like, I'm not really worried about getting them, I think. It's not a big deal. Just the fact that we actually need a, an actual grill. Can you scrap these for protein as well? I mean, it doesn't make sense if you protein, but three, four, Five. What do you get? Protein. Hmm. Cool. Okay, so gotta remember that. Um. Fullness. Oh, I see. So I'm much worse off because of my bad diet. Huh. Neat. Somehow I really need to get more veggies. Which is kind of tough. You? Recipes? Got to make sure if you guys are new to the channel here that uh, if you're going to be doing this, you don't want your aloe green because it's 10 hit points per, you know, like kind of an instant heal. So, it's really good. Um. Break another one of those down. All right, let's take a look outside and see what damage has been done by these zombies. Up, up, up. Thank you. Okay. Lots of things getting broken down here. Okay. Oh, books, books. Scavenging? Neat. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm hiding. So, uh, yes, scavenging. Use. Sorry, I just gotta get ready to actually fight this guy. I have 17 javelins. A bunch of arrows. I guess he got close enough to smell me. I have not had a bath in a while. Away from my. Can you not jump up there? Oh, that is interesting. No. Oh, geez, you can. That's fine. Steve, where are you going, buddy? Come on, Steve. Quit dancing with me. Busting through. There he is. Oh. Well, they know I'm here. They're just gonna break this building down if I don't uh, do something. So let's draw them over to the front of the building where there are spikes to be had. basement. Holy cow. So many of them again. But this is why I want to make an underground base. Because... 
constantly having to replace things is bad. Time management. Oh my. So I guess I'm just lucky they missed the house. Alright. Oh, undetected. So I'm glad I actually didn't see over there. Just one hazmat. She probably saw me. There's a construction worker, which there's spikes down there to be dealing with him. Okay. So I think it might also be a good strategy to take my mini bike along the roads. Well, because there's just bandits on the road, though. It's so tough. And get a bunch of gas and look for more veggies. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's a tough call. But I definitely need to put more spikes down. Okay, so who's left down here? Let's see if we can take some people out. Okay, there's those two burning guys. Being on fire doesn't really gonna help you, buddy. But maybe I can make you want to come here. Come back up there. Because they're attracted to some of like, the highest points at which they think they can get you, so... If they think they can get you, they will oftentimes climb to these locations, right? Keep doing that. Come on. It's a matter now of just hoping I get some timing right. Oh, jeez. Oh, god damn. That was terrible. Sorry, I just fell, and uh, that's bad. So, but my leg is not broken. That dude is too fast. We're going to do the same thing. Okay, let's take care of these same zombies. Get some XP here. Good. My poor buildings. Uh. All right, you. Trying to jump up here. Down, Steve, down. Hold up. Not good. Ah. You're getting overwhelmed by zombies here. Oh, shit. Stop it. Stop breaking things. Why are there still so many zombies coming through? Down. Down. 
down. Get rid of this mess there. Okay, come on. Come on. One of these days you would think that my skills would get me a little bit better at taking these guys out. Okay. Uh, well. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I hear the burning zombie. Someplace. Over here. Undetected. Anyway, guys, we're going to keep dealing with these in the next episode. Um, if they don't despawn. Um, so if you like the episode, hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel and like what you see, hit the subscribe button. And yeah, we'll be back. Might make some more javelins in the meantime. So see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.